We have the new Sony Xperia XZ1. And hello, so who are you? Hi, my name is Damian Stamza, and I'm working as a product marketing manager for Sony Mobile in Germany. So the XZ Premium was already a, a big, big seller, right? Exactly, Very exactly. Device. Yeah, after the MWC, we were really lucky. We packed in all new technology uh, from the new Bion, Bion uh, sensor camera, 4K HDR, the latest Snapdragon. Uh, processing engine, uh, tons of memory, and uh, yeah, now we packed everything in a 5.2 inch device. This one is uh, 5.5. 5.5, now it has a 5.2 inch yeah. version of it, right? Exactly. It's Just got the same chipset? Exactly. Same chipset, uh, same features, HDR. same sure. camera, same HDR display, so just in a smaller form factor. But not 4K, right? Not 4K, no. Because it's too small for 4K. Yes, exactly. But you get a very high okay. resolution, nice Sorry. display. Yes, okay. exactly. So it's a full HD uh, display here. And uh, we can see every content that you uh, want to shoot or take in perfect uh, condition. So. So for some people, 5.5 inches is too big. So uh, exactly. there, right here, you have the, 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 yeah, all the so different the colors you have. Yeah. We have black, we have silver, we have blue, we have pink. Um, and uh, that's also the reason why we said, OK, we need to have something in a smaller form factor, which uh, does fit maybe uh, even more people, so who are not technology leaders, but uh, want to still have the premium package yeah, in a smaller form factor. That's why we have to take the premium away. Yeah. Sure. And then just to show around. So it's, uh, it's uh, the ID of the design is similar. Yeah, exactly. We have an aluminum frame. We have uh, antennas here in the frame built in directly. Uh, we have a USB Type C uh, connector. We we still have a 3.5 inch. Oh, sorry. Uh, uh, audio jack, and we have of course uh, the camera on the back. Like here, still with yeah, NFC. How do you yeah. do this 3D stuff? Is there another sensor here that you're not talking about? Or? No, we have some software. We have some pretty, pretty clever guys uh, sitting in our software engineering. It's software. Yeah, it's software, it's mathematics, yeah, and it's calculation uh, with the help of the uh, ca camera sensor. Because it knows you're moving, it knows where you're moving, you can sense that. Exactly. Very quickly, it makes it 3D, right? Exactly. And uh, the good thing is also that we have a uh, stacked memory uh, on the camera uh, so that all this information that is taken from the image is already collected yeah, and uh, being processed on the go. And uh, that's uh, also the nice part of it because uh, after that you are easily uh, able to create that uh, 3D rendering of yours. And, uh, Everything is called uh, 3D Creator, which we have here as uh, a separate application. And if you have uh, this little lady, you can see her, yeah, even with her hair, perfect, perfectly designed. And even if you zoom in, yeah, you have all the details of her in a 3D scan. So this is helps to be possible because you also have the world's best camera for smartphone, right? Exactly. The stack stuff you're talking about. Yes. Otherwise, other smartphones can't just get this app. No, that, that's also our advantage uh, in terms of uh, 3D scanning. Uh, we might know so, some other uh, vendors like uh, Google uh, who, who do a special uh, technology with infrared scanning, but we do all this with just our Sony camera. You do, you do Project Tango? Yeah, no. with your camera. Yeah, exactly. So soon enough, maybe there's going to be more than only this app. Yeah, yeah. Maybe exactly. you're going to go around the supermarket and scan the supermarket and. Yeah, why not? And you maybe have heard the latest uh, Google AR Core uh, announcement. This might help to create even better augmented reality content then. You can give vision to blind people, I think, also. That should be something you should yep. start doing very soon. Exactly. You have it. Yeah. You basically, you have it. They can put it on their head and they can get audio feedback. They can walk around in the room and they can exactly. know where they are. So it, technology finally becomes really helpful for people that need technology. Indoor yeah. positioning is yes. going to be huge. Exactly. It's going to be a whole new layer in Google Maps, right? Yes. It's coming. Yes, it's coming. Where you can just be indoors and yeah. know where you are. Exactly. We, we have an indoor positioning solution over there, also on our booth. It's called Nimway. Uh, Is so it based on that technology? It's not, no, no, it's not based on this kind of te technology, but uh, it's really important that uh, these kind of features are coming next. Yeah. And then, 
5.2, I think, is quite compact, but some yeah. people want even smaller. Exactly. So, uh, how, how about uh, the smaller brother? brother? Yeah. The XZ1 Same com compact. Exactly. Same feature set. Yeah. Same USB port. Also, 3.5 audio jack. Fingerprint on the size side. We have uh, Qualcomm Snapdragon 835. Same can, camera. Can check if the brightness. Sure. You can even go higher. Sure. This is Bravia display. Exactly, a Trigominus display. And uh, shows all the co nice color contrast and sharpness and everything that you need on a 4.6 inch display. So the best 5.2, the best, best 4.6 in the world, right? Exactly. We're the only true compact uh, vendor out there. Everybody knows that. And uh, this is our commitment that we will stick to this kind of uh, compact form factor without any feature loss. Yeah. Nice. And, uh, and uh, how soon is it? This is available next week and this is available this exactly. week? Exactly. Exactly. So in about two, three weeks, we will have both devices on the market so that we have the perfect trio. Uh, depending on what is your favorite size, 5.5 inch, 5.2 inch, uh, 4.6 inch, no matter what, you have the same chipset and uh, the same camera, the same features on all three devices, so you just choose your size. And the price is going down a little bit for each size? Yes, of course. <laughs> but you don't announce the price yet, right? Uh, we w in Germany, we will have a um, retail price of 699 and 599 of this device. And the bigger one? Uh, the bigger one was at 7.49, so uh, yeah. Two new models in our flagship family to bring you ever more choice and flexibility without compromising our world-class technologies. These new models are 5.2 inch Xperia XZ1, and 4.6 inch XZ1 Compact. Actually, you can see mine being scanned up there. It's very quick, easy to do, and the result in a very high, high quality render. You can scan your entire face or head or an object like food in either 180 or 360 degrees within a matter of one minute. And it's really easy to edit this 3D data to create your own 3D avatar, <laughs> just like that. I'm turning into anything now, right? I'm proud to share with you that these will be amongst the first smartphones in the industry to be launched with recently announced Android 8.0 Oreo. Thank you.